Okay, so in the last movie, basically we saw this circuit where we had two batteries uh, stacked on top of each other. The current goes from positive through this, making it light up, and then back here to negative. Well, in this, we're going to talk about this circuit, which is an LED, which looks like that. You've seen this in a lot of the uh, computers. It's a green light that lights up when things happen. The current will still go from here, here, to here, just like before. The only problem is, when we do this, and the reason why I left it disconnected, it's very efficient, and too much current goes, and actually this, this entire bulb will get hot and burn out and die if it was connected like this just straight to the battery. So what we're going to do instead, we're not going to do this, we're always going to do this. Let me let the camera focus. So the current will go through this thing we call a resistor, which um, slows it down so that when it goes through the LED, it won't kill the LED. In other words, batteries can put out so much current, it can be so powerful, that it can really kill a lot of components, one of them being these LEDs, but there's a lot of other components we have to worry about as well. This is just one of many examples. So we're going to put the battery right here, have the current go through a resistor on the way to an LED. And so when we do that, it doesn't burn out, and it's still pretty bright. That's how we protect our components using a resistor. We control the current. We um, kind of tame it, I guess you can say, so that it won't destroy uh, the parts we use.